Chris, this is bringing the bobbin thread up and getting your machine prepared to sew. So you've got your bobbin here. If you have a little piece of thread hanging off, I always like to just see it fold off. You take your bobbin. This is your bobbin case. And each one of these machines are actually tuned so that um, the bobbin case goes with the machine and it has a number written on the bobbin. There's a piece of thread in this and I can't get it out. Okay. So you place your bobbin inside your bobbin case. You pull thread around to this little loop here through the loop up around and then you're going to thread it through the top of your bobbin case there's a little hole right here well I say you're gonna thread it Okay, now we have that in there. You give it a little pull, pull out a little thread. To put your bobbin case inside your machine, you wanna pull this out because it will hold your bobbin case in, okay? Or your bobbin in. Whenever, um, make sure you can see this underneath here. Whenever you get ready to put your bobbin case inside your machine, there is a little um, silver holder in here and there is a gap in the top. You wanna to make sure that there's a hole inside of the machine. And this is the only time that you really um, should ever turn your hand wheel to the back so that you can actually see the little gap in there. Because if you try to put this in there and the gap is not open where the metal and the plastic meet, the bobbin case is not gonna go in there correctly. Did you hear how it snapped in? It will not snap in if there's not an opening right there. And if there's not an opening, it's gonna fall out and then your, your thread is gonna get all tangled up, your bobbin's gonna get tangled up. So that is how you put your bobbin in. Um, and now we're gonna take the bobbin thread from the bottom and pull it up through this little hole right here. That must be done before you start sewing. And once you have it, um, the only time you have to change that is if you do a new bobbin. So you take your hand wheel, you turn it one complete loop until you feel it loop all the way around, and then you just give your bobbin thread a gentle snug pull with your top thread, and it comes up through it. So basically what it's doing is it's looping around the bottom, and then once this thread, the top thread, loops around the bottom um, to make that lock stitch, then you can give it a tug and pull it up through here. And now your machine is threaded and ready to go.